Hey everybody, so today I'm here to share a fall baby clothing haul and I'm just going to go ahead and get started because there's a lot of stuff here. I have zero to three months stuff and then I also have three to six months stuff and I wasn't expecting to get any of the zero to three months stuff until I saw that for whatever reason we didn't have like any onesies at all for Lexi so that kind of started something and then we just got carried away. So. Um, I do have a couple of like holiday outfits as well and holiday stuff, but I guess I'll just start off with the things that I was supposed to buy first and foremost. So like I said, we didn't really have any onesies for her, like long sleeve onesies. So I wanted to go ahead and get some of those and I wanted to get some pants to match them. So I found these pants from Old Navy and they are kind of like a waffle knit, which I love. Here's the other pair, burgundy. That's coming up a little bit more red on camera there. That's a more true to color right there. Both sizes of these pants are zero to three months and I feel like they'll work really well with the different onesies that I got. And I got this little navy rainbow onesie, appropriate. And then I got this little like baseball tee one, which I thought was super cute. I've never seen like a baseball onesie tee made for a little girl. And then this one with just some flowers on it, which I wasn't loving any of these really, like from Old Navy, but at the time they were all I could find and I was worried that I wouldn't find anything else. So I just wanted to get something in case she like rapidly grew into that size because she's pretty close to being into three month clothes, which breaks my heart. But then I found this on eBay. I love going to eBay for things that are hard to find. This is from Jamboree, which is no longer a store in the United States. I think I might have seen that they're actually planning to come back in like 2020, but right now we don't have one. My friend Crystal here on YouTube sent me a rainbow onesie of Jamborees and I went on eBay and I bought a bigger size of it. And so now she's got two of those and it's the same rainbow from that. And I just had to. And all of their clothes so far have been so soft and like thick. I'm really sad that they went out of business because I'd probably be hitting them up for some clothes right now. And then I did end up finding these at Target. They were pretty much all sold out online. I saw these online and I went in store to hopefully find them. Thankfully I did. But they're just plain onesies. And you guys know if you've watched any of my other hauls that I live for this for girls. I don't need sparkles and unicorns and neon colors on everything. Like my girls can hang in just some basics too. So this has like a burgundy, almost like a... a pinky burgundy color a light pink and then a gray onesie and I was super excited to find these but like I said online they're pretty much sold out but my store had a lot of options so definitely check your target if you want to find these and from there it's mostly just sleepers and seasonal stuff I guess I'll put these aside for the holiday outfits at the end but I did get a couple of sleepers because I couldn't help myself at Walmart they were so cute um, this is also in three months, which looks really big, honestly, for three months. And with these Wonder Nation onesies that they have now, or sleepers, whatever you call them, they have the zipper from the bottom up, just like the Target Cloud Island does. And I really like the feel of these Wonder Nation ones. These actually feel like pretty nice quality compared to some of the Walmart ones you can get. In my opinion, the clothes from Walmart, even like the Carter's, brand can start to feel a little rough, a little thin, and they get smaller super quicker in my opinion. But these actually feel really nice. So I got that one and then I saw this one. I I don't know where the llama theme started for Lexi, but it started and I'm not stopping. So it's got this adorable little llama on the front of it, which actually matches her llama wubba nub we use for the car seat and it's so cute. And again, it's got the zipper down here at the bottom and I washed both of these already, but I wanna say these were only around like five or six dollars. They didn't even break the seven dollar mark if I remember correctly, but they're super cute. They had other options as well. I just can't remember off the top of my head what they were. I just got those. And then the last things in the three to month size 
before I get into holiday stuff are just a few outfits. So these all came from Walmart, but it's got this yellow little top and then these floral bottoms. And it's all this brand from Walmart, the child of mine line that they have there. And I find that the outfits like this are a little better quality than their sleepers, but still the clothes aren't as nice as if you get them from actual Carters, but they also aren't as expensive. And then there is this outfit with these pants, and those are coming up way brighter on camera than what they actually are. They're much, much darker in person. And then the last one, and probably one of my favorites, is just this cute little basic polka dot muted colors with these cute like little wooden-ish buttons and then some little jean pants with hearts for pockets i mean come on oh i guess they are actually pockets but still cute nonetheless so those were all of just like the regular clothes that i got in zero to three months and then there was some holiday stuff i did find this sleeper on i believe it was poshmark or something like that but it says my first Halloween. I love to find sleepers like this and do my first holiday pictures for those. It's just super easy, especially when they're little like this. You know, I don't have to put a sticker on her or anything. It's just I can get up close, make sure that you can read this in the picture, and it counts. So I thought this was super cute. I love this little ghost, and it's pretty basic. So if you guys know of any good ones for Thanksgiving and Christmas, I still need to find ones for those. But speaking of Halloween, I also did get this My First Halloween onesie from... Uh, Target I believe and I really just liked the look of this I could put this with any kind of pants and she could wear that and then this is from Old Navy but I got the cutest pumpkin in the patch and that is everything for the zero to three month size so a lot of Walmart a little bit of Target and a lot of just random places honestly and then I'm going to get started in the three to six month size. The first thing is something her sisters picked out for her. They saw this and I thought it'd be useful, so that's also why we got it. But it was from Target and it's one of those zip up fleece kind of, I don't know, onesies, but not the kind you would probably put them to sleep in because it has a hood on it. These are great for the car seat. I don't do winter jackets in the car seat. I just stick them in these and they zip up. They're nice. They keep them warm, but it's not, it's like the layering, not actually sticking a whole coat on them. And it's got a hood. Obviously it's covered in dinosaurs, so it's got a dinosaur hood. And her sisters just lost it when they saw this. And they asked if they could get it for her. And I believe that was even before she was here. So we got that for her. And then this is also from Target. This little onesie pack. Again, you could probably put them to sleep in these. I think Remy had something similar. And I did like to let her sleep in them. But they don't have any footies on them. And they also don't have any mittens. These are more made as like outfits. And then I got this outfit from Carter's which is another little llama. And then it came with these pants. And then I got this onesie from Old Navy. Come on, how cute is that? So adorable. And then I got these onesies from Target <laughs> that have the llama on them. And then this one says Mama's Mini. And then this one just has a little bit of woodland creatures on it. Lexi does also spit up a fair amount so I got some of the Carter's bibs, the ones that match those llama outfits. So home is where mama is which I love that. And then this one with just llamas all over it and this one that has the woodland creatures. And I have never seen these in store. I did see those llama onesies and also the matching pants in store but the bibs I could only find online. So I got this sleeper from Carter's, which is a llama, as you can see. And it's fleece. That'll be great because the six month size is what she'll be in for most of our winter, like the harsh, harsh winter. And then I found this little sister sleeper at Walmart. It's that Carter's of mine brand. I think it was around $7. And then this is actually nine months. It was a mistake. I meant to get it in six months, so I'm going to return it and get the right size, but it's this dinosaur 
um, sleeper. Couldn't think of a name real quick, but it's got the footies. It's so cute. And then from there, I just have holiday stuff. So to kind of start it off, I got this pack of dresses mainly just for one for Thanksgiving, but it came with two. And the one that I won't be using for Thanksgiving is this one that has rainbows on it, but it's still adorable and obviously super fitting for a rainbow baby. But this is the dress I wanted for Thanksgiving because it matches her sister's. And then for Christmas, I already have her older sister's dresses picked out as well. And she is going to be wearing this. And this is from H&M out of the baby section. I thought, I just loved this, especially with her sister's dresses. It's so perfect. And then the rest of the stuff is holiday stuff from Carter's. This is all six months as well. This is a onesie pack. And I loved these holiday onesies with all of my girls because we do so many Christmas activities and I got Christmas onesies for all of them and it just makes for some really cute photos. There's this red one that's got polka dots and then there's this one with a whole bunch of holiday animals on it. This emerald green one which I love, tiny little gold bows. And I actually really like this red floral one. And all the reds are not coming up true on screen for whatever reason. This is like a true like Christmas red color, not like an orangey that's kind of coming up. And then I got this. I'm so glad I got it when I did. Reflecting, I was like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have got this. But it went back up in price and it's kind of stayed there. So I'm glad I did. But it was this little reindeer like cardigan, almost jacket because it's pretty heavy but I loved it. I thought it'd be so adorable for just like the occasions we go out for like picking out our Christmas tree and stuff like that. I thought it'd be so cute to have her wear this. It is normally $36. Ridiculous. It stayed around like 18 now, but I got it for like seven bucks when it was on sale. So I'm super excited about that. And like I said, that's super like it's thick. I would consider that almost like a jacket. It's that thick. And then one last thing for Christmas, I got her a little holiday sleeper. It doesn't say my first Christmas on it, but I, you guys know me, I'm a sucker for like this waffle knit thermal kind of material. And the fact that it was just like kind of basic, but with these red buttons, I was sold. So that is everything for our fall baby haul. I give you a little bit of winter in there too, but honestly, sometimes our Christmases aren't really that winterish. We could have like no snow. We'll just have to wait and see. It's normally like January, February, March. That is like our awful winter. Let me know down below when your guys' winter starts, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as always, thanks for watching.